How we doing? It's Mailman Nick. Find me on Instagram at Nick Venti. If you enjoy this content, please give me a thumbs up. Don't treat me like a tool for a B over here. And obviously, these are my own thoughts and opinions. I do not speak on behalf of the Postal Service. So I want to give you guys an update for the week. This whole week, I've been sick. And I'm still getting over it. I still have a cough. I still, uh, you know, runny nose and things like that. But I'm way better than when the start of the week. It all started with my car getting towed. And then I started getting sick. So the whole week was uh, almost felt like a dream, a blur. But we got through it. We got through it. And... Uh, you know, today I was able to, you know, I was, I feel a lot better than what I did early in the week. So, uh, you know, I went to the White Sox game, uh, Chicago White Sox opening weekend, uh, South Side. I'm still, I'm a Cubs fan too, but you know, obviously I live in the South Side. So cool going to a Sox game. I haven't been to a White Sox game in a few years. Then uh, went to Pequod's. Pequod's is some of the best pizza in Chicago. Deep dish. That's, that's so good. So good. Then uh, got some dessert too. The cookie with the whipped cream. It was fire. So uh, had a really nice Easter. Hopefully you guys enjoyed your Easter as well. Um, yeah, work. It's been... Because we're down so many people. We're down so many people. I could name like at least like six carriers who aren't at work for for various reasons. It's it's bad. Um so some carriers got 4 hours of extra yesterday. The only reason why I didn't get 4 hours extra was because it was my NS day, it was my weekend. But I came in Friday. I worked I think I worked 10 hours, a little over 10 hours on Friday and then a little over 10 hour or no, I worked 10 and a half yesterday, so 10, 10 and a half hours on my day off. But like the thing, that this is why you got to look at the light blue every day because for some reason they didn't take, they took my lunch out. They took my lunch out. You know, you guys know I signed the no lunch policy. Uh, so I signed the no lunch policy. That means I don't take a lunch. They don't, they, they shouldn't take my lunch out, but you know, I'm going to wait a day or two, see if they change it. If not, then you got to say something because I didn't, uh, you know, I worked 10 and a half hours, but it said I worked 10 hours and that that's a half hour of penalty that I'm missing. And the only reason because I'm the, what I'm thinking is because they said they gave me two hours extra, but the thing was, I was already halfway to my route. I get a call from my supervisor. Hey, come back and take your extra with you so I had to go all the way back to the office right which you know doesn't take me a, like a like snap of my fingers I have to drive all the way back there so drove drive back to the office and then my packages weren't separated so I had to go through the the gurney and pick my own packages out for my for my extra and apparently I took more DPS because the DPS looked like it was separated this is why I was all messed up and I really hope they change it because uh, I would have made 630 if uh you know, I didn't have, they originally gave me two hours on 12, right? But they said, basically fend for yourselves, grab the, grab the parts. And the DPS wasn't separated yet, apparently. So I just grabbed the DPS and it had Michael to the end, which is almost half the route. So I had almost half the route. I had to come back when I was already halfway to my route. They said, come back and pick it up. And then I had to go through the gurney and, hand pick my packages for my own extra so that all takes time that's why it took me an extra half hour to get done and honestly i could have probably taken an, another half hour really if we're being if we're being real it could have been easily 7 30 but uh you know mail was light mail was light but at the same time you know that all takes time like going back to the office uh you know grabbing the dps uh you know, finding my own packages in the gurney. Luckily, I know that route, so uh, it didn't take me too long, but I still had to take time, separated, things like that. Um, so I really hope they change. You guys got to make sure you monitor your light blue. That's why I check it religiously every day. Also, my brother, he just got a job. He had a shadow day yesterday. He went through academy, so tomorrow he'll be, you know, delivering mail. He's uh, in the south suburbs with me. Uh, he's in the same district, so... That'll be nice to, uh, you know, if he if he has any questions, you know, he could ask me, call me, and uh, 
you know, I'll help them out. It's a very small office. My route has, or my office has 63 routes. His his office has only six. He said it's like the size of a subway. So that's going to be very convenient. It's going to be very, uh, the only thing it's like a half hour from our house. But uh, the good thing is that, you know, only like six routes to learn. Uh, less volume probably. So, uh, you know, I'll keep you guys updated on what he tells me on a small office because I'm a more medium size office. Like I said, 63 routes, that's like medium. Uh, six, six routes is like very uh, small. So whatever he tells me how like the, how they run things, you know, I'll, you know, tell you guys, hey, this is how like, you know, a smaller office operates and things like that. Um, but yeah, he's C CCA, CCA. And uh, same thing with probably all you guys. He's waiting for that contract and hopefully get some back pay. Hopefully start off as a career hopefully they you know do away with the cca position hopefully they uh change it to just ptf because after your 90 days you should be career it's it's just stupid how it's not uh how you're not career you have to wait two years uh but yeah hopefully it's uh hopefully they get away with the cca position ptf Start off at that twenty two thirteen an hour, and uh, let's get this money. Let's get these benefits. So, uh, but yeah, that's basically it. Uh, had my weekend. Uh, had fun today. Sox game. Pequods. Start off Monday again. Uh, you know, hopefully the weather starts getting nicer. It's it. It could be like seventy one day, and then thirty the next day. Illinois weather is uh, ridiculous. So hopefully it starts getting nicer. Hopefully it doesn't rain as much as it usually does in the spring. Let's get this money. So thank you guys all for tuning in. Please like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video.